how do you get your Salesforce data out of like Salesforce itself and into your Apex code? Or maybe you've been asked to write a report or generate a very quick answer to finding like the number of accounts that don't have any open opportunities. Well, instead of like building a report or doing some weird CSV type of thing, you can use SOQL. This is one of the most important skills I think for any Salesforce professional. It doesn't matter if you're a designer, admin, BA, even a developer, Salesforce Object Query Language or SOQL, not to be confused with SQL or SOSL, is super important yeah. for you to learn. SOQL is used to search your organization for specific information. So maybe you're looking for opportunities with certain criteria or accounts or you name it, you can search your org using an SOQL query. Traditionally, this is thought of as a developer thing, right? You're gonna use it in Apex or Lightning Web Components, but there are other use cases for SOQL on the platform. SQL is great for those quick little data questions that come up all the time. How many opportunities do we have? How many of those opportunities are related to this specific record? How many of those opportunities are closed one with an amount greater than 100K? Right? These types of things are great to just pop into quick SQL queries once you know the basics of it. And you can use those queries that you've built once it's refined down in tools like the Salesforce Data Loader or Workbench to actually export that information and even technically update it, but I wouldn't recommend that all the time. Knowing SOQL will help you understand databases, and that's all Salesforce really is. It's a super powered database for the most, you know, boiled down for the most part. So once you know SOQL, you'll get a glimpse of how the data models under the hood actually works because you'll be working with things like the API names, the references, and pulling data from different objects where you may not have had as much access to before. I did mention SOQL is normally seen as a developer thing, but it can really come in clutch in certain situations for configurators and people that maybe aren't developers. Just imagine you're sitting in an interview and there is some sort of relationship information that you picked up from an SOQL query that really helped you edge yourself a lot higher than another candidate. Or conversely, maybe you're working on a team with developers and you're able to speak more confidently on development aspects because you understand SOQL. Just like with anything on the Salesforce platform, it's gonna take time and practice to get good at it, but learning SOQL can come in handy in many different situations, not just programming. But since it's similar to programming, you'll be able to transfer those skills with SOQL to many other query languages like SQL, or just using it in other areas areas of Salesforce that you work with. There's a bunch of Salesforce resources like Trailhead that you can read up on how SQL works. But if you're looking to get some hands-on experience with SOQL, check out this video over here, here, wherever it actually is to get hands-on experience. And if you're looking to take it to the next level, check out my course, The Ultimate Guide to SOQL, which takes you from not knowing kind of anything about SQL to becoming an SQL wizard. So thanks so much for watching. I'm Walters954 and remember, I believe in you.